Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is the Comms Prepper. It's a little after 8 p.m. Sunday evening and I'm getting ready to check in to the American Preparedness Radio Network. I have the ICOM IC7300 HF radio set up here on the patio with Chameleon Antenna's new version 2.0 P-Loop antenna with power compensator. We're going to try to check into that net tonight, but I thought I'd do the opener while we still had some sunlight. You'll notice something different from my earlier video, and that's a bag of sand on the tripod. Just after I shot the last video, a gust of wind blew the antenna over and slammed this tuner box into the ground. But it came out unscathed. I got a little bit of scratch on there, but it still tunes up just fine. So before it gets too dark, I have one of the comms prepper helpers out here. Hey, preppers. And she's going to help me videotape the display of this radio, and I'm going to demonstrate how adjusting the tuning knob on the bottom of the P-loop antenna will change the residence of the antenna and you can actually see that indication on the display as the sensitivity of the waterfall shifts up and down the band. So I'll pass the camera off and we'll show you how that works. Okay, so watch the waterfall display and as I tune the knob you'll see the waterfall display change going up and down the band and that's the antenna actually tuning across that band. I'll bring it back towards the center. We'll go up past the center and you can see where the receive sensitivity is strongest and where it actually gets weaker. And I'll actually tune out of the band and you'll see the signals com almost completely drop from the waterfall display. We'll bring the antenna back down to a tune position. And now we're about center on the frequency there in the middle of the display. So what I'll do now is hunt for the frequency of the tapper nut this evening. Do my coarse tune, then fine tune, and see if we can check in at 9 o'clock on the American Preparedness Radio Network running 60 watts on the ICOM IC7300 and Chameleon Antenna's new P-Loop antenna. We'll be right back at around 9 o'clock. Yep, that's what it is. Yeah, it was uh, 88, or no, 85, 86 here today. Well, that lake uh, breeze, that uh, really keeps it cool here because Akron is about 70-something. Yeah, good old Cleveland with all that cloud cover, right? Yeah, well, the sun did come out today, but that wind... All right, guys, I got everything tuned up. It's almost 15 minutes past the hour, and I'm starting to think that the tapper net may have been canceled this weekend because of Mother's Day. I can't find it anywhere, and I'm having no problems picking up stations with the Chameleon P-Loop antenna up and down the East Coast and over towards the Mississippi. It tuned up just fine, running 60 watts with the power compensator. We're able to transmit out with no problems. I just can't find the tapper net, so can't really show you checking into it if they're not holding the net. We'll go ahead and wrap this video up, get it rendered, and get it posted on the YouTube. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. This has been the Comms Prepper with an evening demonstration of the ICOM IC7300 matched up with Chameleon Antenna's new version 2.0 P-Loop antenna. Thanks for watching, guys.